Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Esports Arena North American Weekly. Now, we're still telling the scores, but we've got one final breakdown here. And this is what we decided, what you, Tom, decided was the final winning possible moment for Rogue here. As uh, Let's go ahead and break down this team fight that you wanted to talk about. Yeah, no doubt about it that Rogue has the superior positioning here, and that's why they left the ship and put this team in the position. But it's all about Sweet and that opening damage, that 147, just perfect recoil control. That's the enemy rate that really just opens this fight up. Almost the barrels are not even relevant at that point because of the fact that you get lasered so hard and you can see the rest of the team just collapsing and not one player gets down, so they're not too worried about the third party. They can armor swap perfectly. And you can see drop just a little sliver alive is able to live there and get away and that makes a big difference when you get those kill points because you're fighting against godsent who was just dominating the first couple of games had 44 points after the first two games so you know you got to play this perfectly and it's exa exactly what rogue did fantastic job from them yeah, and this was the final fight uh, between Rogue and NRG, where we thought Rogue had it. Good damage coming across. We had a great crossfire being set up by Rogue, but what went wrong for them here? I think what went wrong was when ha what happened was Rogue dropped here. Uh, it was actually dropped who did drop. He comes behind and puts a lot of damage down, and we don't get a chance to see the other two points of view, but what I'm assuming is that all three players focused one player immediately, took him down, and then snipe down exactly what happens sweet gets taken out first then snipe down is too uh away from the fight there because he doesn't realize that dropped had flanked a perfect gibby bubble and nice caustic barrels zoning the players out from rogue is why they're able to take that one energy from such a horrible position not having the high ground is able to win that fight and unfortunately for them didn't have a strong previous three games so it didn't really mean much for them in terms of getting the points but it's really nice just for the practice for the team chemistry for the confidence going in and that's what these tournaments are so great for